Hello everyone, Citizen Zero here, and welcome to part 11 of my playthrough on Wolfenstein The New Order. So in my last playthrough episode, I managed to free Setroth from the confines of Camp Bellica, and in this episode, well for now at least, I have to find some molding equipment for Seth so that he can get the little submersible in working order, the one that Max put on the table in the ending of last episode. So yeah, let me get back down here because I think I think this is gonna be I think this is gonna be like my little intro hold on. Sorry about that. So as I was trying to say, I think I'm just gonna every time I begin recording my videos, I'm just gonna you know, begin up, you know, start the recording like the introduction up here because it's uh, peaceful and there's no like, and there's like no perp NPCs talking in the background, so to speak. So, yeah. Alright, let me go downstairs and find that welding equipment. No idea what the heck it could be. Uh, question mark, uh, exclamation mark. Hi, Max. Alright, um, where is it? Of course, um... Help Set locate any part he might need, okay? Yeah, um... I don't know where it could be, lady. Um, wait, there was an exclamation mark on this floor, wasn't there? Well, at least... Here? In the hangar, but he's tinkering with them helicopters. What? What? Oh, so was that that I was looking? For? So that was? Is that what I was looking for in the hangar? Oh. Okay. Just, the exclamation mark just leads me to a note. Okay. Who's in the hangar? Oh, they might. It might be. Fergus. Uh, where is Fergus? These are... Fergus! What are you? Fergus? No? Oh, Fergus! What do you want, Blazkowicz? Looking for the welder. You seen it? No, I don't think so. No, oh, wait a minute. No, you're right, you're right. I was meaning to sort out the railing over by the secret fountain entrance. The fucking thing fell out of my hand into the water. I'm a bit busy at the moment, but you want the welder, you go right on ahead and start swimming. The door to the secret fountain entrance is in the main room behind the table. Go over there and you should find the welder somewhere down in the water somewhere. Yeah, I you can you can definitely tell Fergus is still quite visibly upset that I chose him to survive instead of Wyatt. Well, here I mean I want I like I want Fergus to live, so we expect him to do. Alright, so I think I gotta move Bombate out of the way. Alright, yep. Excuse me, Bombate. Sorry, pal. Don't mean to, you know, derail your train of thought, but uh, I need to get through that door. Ugh, please. What I think about, I'd rather not think about. <laughs> that bad, huh? Jay would think that when Jay seen what I have, your mind would break like an egg. How come it has not? Well, maybe it has begun already and I just don't know it. World changing. No matter who you are, what you're made of. Thing is, you and me, we just gotta ride the whirlwind, make it through to the other side. And kill all the Nazis? <laughs> and kill all the Nazis. I would drink with you in celebration for near that time come. You're on. I'm going to lie, I love, I like Bombate. He's such a cool character. Oh wow, look at that little booby trap. It's a tight corridor, no kidding. I right, physical file line of Nazis. Ooh, man, they'll be sliced to me. Diced meat. Uh. Alright, oh, down. No. Oh, crap. Alright. Cutty, cutty. Good. Mmm, chart you up. I'm not going to lie. I'm, I'm, I'm actually glad that I changed my name from Zero Day to Citizen Zero. But... The name suit, the suit, the, the name suit, Citizen Zero. I love it better. It's always in the, it's always been in the back of my head, because 
I was because whenever I go through a name change, I'm like, maybe we can do Citizen Zero, Citizen, you know, Citizen Zero, Citizen Z. But knowing that I can't do it because there'll be like thousands of other channels with the same name. So, like I said in my name change video, that's why I decided to change some letters around in the zero portion of the name. Hence why I can finally do the Citizen Zero name. And I absolutely adore and love it. So, yeah. Alright, we're gonna go grab the leather. Leather? Welder. Ugh. You tell me, like. Why can't I come back up these pipes? Right, oh, that was a big, big mass leap. Alright. Which is, yeah, knowing that I could change out some words, letters in the zero word, in, in the zero portion of the my name, and then realize that I can apply that to the citizen zero name. Yeah. I kind of like that. Having my name being citizen zero now instead of some other stupid name. Don't get me wrong, I, lo I adored the Zero Day name, but it wasn't me, so. That's why I w w decided to go with Citizen Zero, because it's always been in the back of my head, really. Some, some, you know, a name that I would, you know, die if the end of the world came, so to speak, you know? But yeah. Where am I going? To jump up there? Oh, I'm lame, alright. Okay. For now. Oh. Alright. Uh. That works. Chainsaw Red Hot too. That's nice. Ellie, you. People starting to doubt their own supposed great leader. Alright. Let's go this way? I guess so. Okay. Yeah, they're, uh, yeah, we're hiding right beneath your feet, people. <laughs> uh, last place, the last place it would ever look is right beneath their nose. Seriously, 100% body armor. Should I be concerned as to why he's giving me body armor in the sewers? Crap! I remember this. Those robotic super soldier Frankenstein monsters. Great. All right. Ah, ah. Yay. Not exactly what I need right now. Alright. Uh... Alright. I remember there being a Frankenstein monster that I can actually- put I think I can hide under here. Which is actually nice. Earth. I actually had under here before I activate anything. Yes, I can. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's go. Oh, 
Hey, <laughs> yeah, you reach me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Not good. Oh, uh, crap. Um, oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, Lord. Oh, uh, they charge, they charge, they charge, they charge, they charge. Thank you. Watch the door. Or be slow. Ooh. Okay. Oh, sweet Jesus! No. Okay, that was too close. Oh, oh, oh. It's actually blocking? Yes. I'm saved. Oh, good lord. <laughs> it's like right there. Um, what just happened? I'm sorry, but... Huh? How did... How did that Frankenstein monster grab me to the... <laughs> Love this game and its mechanics. Seriously, that's nice. Alright, uh... Maybe you such... Great. Recharge, 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 recharge. Oh, it actually worked. So wait, there was just... Oh, I was just getting actual... Okay. Okay, I was trying to figure out why, like, the laser wasn't melting through the metal. Their laser... I was trying to figure out why their laser miniguns weren't melting, melting through the metal sh slab, the metal sheet right here to... And now I realize, is that not, not actually, uh, not actually lasers, just regular old bullets. Nice. Alright. Just carry this thing with me, because I am not going anywhere without this. The MG46, let's go. Oh, God. Why, why are there even, Frankenstein monsters even in here anyways? Probably because it is an old Frank, uh, an old, uh, Nazi railroad system, judging by the tracks. Jesus Christ. Alright, uh. uh. Wenden Sie sich bitte an das Bürgerinformationsbüro, ja? Wissen Sie, wo es ist? Einfach die Straße runter und dann links, ein braunes Haus. 
Sie können es nicht reparieren. Dort können Sie das melden und einen schönen Tag machen. Na gut. Vielen Dank, Herr Offizier. Okay, wow, guys are really almost both then. Jesus. Okay. Alright, uh where do I go now? Oh don't tell me I have to take really I have to do don't tell me I have to really leave my I get my minigun behind. Really? Oh, never mind. Ah, I'm trying to figure out why it was so, why just like dead end. I don't know. That'll explain it. Alright, uh. Nope. Why is it set Roth? Why is my. Okay, I'm a little bit puzzled now by that. Weird. Uh, oh, for a lousy welder. Next time you go get it, Fergus. And I just lost my welder. That's nice. Hi, Anna. Oh, I'm sorry. It's just my wedding ring. It's gone. I'm always so clumsy. I lost it when we got back. It's not worth much, but it's all I have left of him. My dear Sebastian. Oh, I'll try to look for it. Uh, here you go. If we're uh, going to steal a Nazi U-boat, I need Set to repair that thing on the table. Help him with his work, will you? Uh, here. Oh, Isha Koch, Shimshon, Isha Koch. That's all I need. Or actually, would you uh, deliver this note to Anya? She will need the frequency of the transponder to track the thing. Like I'm the goddamn errand boy. <laughs> yep. Here you go, Anya. William. Do you have a moment? Oh no. Schon wieder mit dieser Unsinn. Lass uns diese Leute. It will happen, William. Believe it. Finish up your dirty laundry. You're leaving. But not today. Listen to my voice, Blaskovich. There you are now, inside sewage tunnels. The intestinal tracks of the city. And deeper below, the Berlin catacombs. A vast complex. The most secure site in all Berlin. The central munition stockpile of the Nazi regime. The things we could do with those weapons. Right. We revolt. This access route is waterlocked. Impenetrable to outsiders. There's only one way to breach across the perimeter. It's a tunnel glider. The Nazis use them for maintenance down there. We've been trying for years to bring it up to working order. This is the first phase of the plan to gain access to Set's underwater safe keep. Use the tunnel glider to find a way into the weapons depot in the burning catacombs. Anya has agreed to track your position over the transponder and provide tactical support. Good luck, Sir Blaskovich. These are deep waters. William, can you hear me? You have to make your way all the way through the sewer tunnels and into the Berlin catacombs. I'll try to guide you through. All right, and if I remember correctly, in this, uh, Blaskowitz is gonna recall, I guess, moments of his childhood. I think I don't remember. I don't remember to be honest. Let's go. Hello. W and S, W and S, move forward and backward, moves mouse to steer. Ah, okay, cool. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, here, okay. Good to know. Let's see. Just follow the pipeline. Yeah. 
Oh, the back line. Da 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 da. Oh. <laughs> Just bounce off the pipelines like a ping pong ball. You might have to exit the tunnel glider to neutralize obstacles in your way. Don't lose track of the tunnel glider. It's your only source of oxygen. That's a comfort. I was a kid. The red tide was rising. Went in the water on account of disobeying father. Felt like my skin was on fire. Now in that one battle... Like my skin was on fire. Now in that one battle with the two Frankenstein monsters, I'm not sure how that one man would grab me through the catwalk. I'm not sure how. That was just unbelievable, really. Yeah. All right. I'm not sure how he managed to grab me to the catwalk. He just like bathes his hand. He like just bathes his. Right underneath the Eisenwald prison now. Oh my. Caroline told me a few inmates tried to escape through the sewer system with some valuables a few years ago. They didn't make it very far. Oof. But I just that finds me funny that the Frankenstein monster just phases his hand through this metal steel cow. He just grabs me and phases me out of it. That's just hilarious right there. Alright, uh, where are you now? I... Some areas might be too narrow for the tunnel glider. You may have to swim. Oh, okay. Yeah, figures have to come from the other side. Alright. It shows me like he, it shows me. Oh, I was about to say, it shows me like the animation in the animation of entering the the glider, but doesn't do the out, outro of the exiting it. So it just teleports me in and out. All right, a little lame, but yeah, whatever. Thirteen years old, from the pond by the stables, came out covered in leeches. <gasps> What the heck you drown in here? Apparently you can. As my screen is again. Really, really dark. That's nice. Alright, uh... Let's see, why can I not go through? William, I have something I want to tell you. I've been mm. reading this diary my grandmother gave. It's my cousin Ramona's diary. She used to work with us at the asylum. She's dead now, but she had many secrets inside of her. And there was no one she could trust to keep them. So she wrote them all down. I will radio the diary entries to your audio lock. If you find the time, you can listen. Yeah. Where am I? Whoa. Who? Okay, I don't think I want to know now. Uh, right. Go through here, I guess. I don't know. We're still on the waypoint, really. The section you are in now, it's been out of commission for a long time. But some machinery might still be manually operable. We should re reposition the pump wheel. Hey, how to Oh, that arm. Makes sense, really. Um. Oh. Hey, okay. oh, right here. Okay, hold on to it. Oh, that's okay. Oh no! Hey, where did the pistol come Spring from? Any water in my days. None as cold as this. Okay. What's next? Um, go oh, through here. Okay.
The deep basin was used to regulate overflow. You will have to find a way to reach the platform on the other side. That bandit's ladder has something to do with it, doesn't it? Looks like a watertight door, yep. Flooded the okay, flooded flooded a lot. Lord. This is fine now? Yes it is. Bunga. That was flooded a lot. Oh, to make room for the tunnel glider, okay. That's a waste of good ingenuity. I mean, that's a smart design, too. I can actually see, see someone building that in real life. Seriously, that's like a clever and genius little invention. Seriously, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, um. I think I see where the water flow is going now, yeah. Does it jump in here? Ow, yeah, but I hurt myself in the process. Age 11. Swam across Forney Lake on a bed over ten soldiers. But it wasn't as dark oh. as this. What was it old World War II mine doing here? <laughs> Two World War II mines? Okay. Interesting. At least. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, that's like, these are like old, old World War II mines. How do they end up here, right? Beyond me. And one of the punctures the gate just now. And the other one's about to puncture the other gate, right? And... That's the... The little... Concrete berries don't trip the spikes. Imagine people were just walking around like you should just hear that from the sewer. It's like, what was that? There's not someone throwing it down throwing a cherry bomb down the toilet. <laughs> Alright, um, okay. What does he even lead to? Like this. Age 32. Swam the cesspools beneath Death's Head's axe labs. But it wasn't as dirty as this. I'm not sure if I want to know where that giant massive tunnel is. Age still. 19. Dove down the well to salvage Father's watch. But it wasn't as deep as this. But that's just we look at look how clear the water is. It looks like just that nothing's down there until I actually go closer. That's freaky to be honest. This is beyond freaky. Alright, um where am I? Open to this other side, okay. Oh. William, directly above you are the catacombs. There is an elevator that can take you right into the weapons depot. Nice. Alright folks, on a call here for the episode. I thank y'all so much for watching. If you did enjoy this episode and you are enjoying the Wolfenstein The New Order series so far, then make sure to give some sort of feedback in the form of a like, comment, share, subscription, whatever. But yeah, any but any sort of feedback 
does help in supporting the ch in supporting the channel and helping it spread across the YouTube community. So I'm grateful for that. Nothing else to say, folks. I bid you all a farewell.